Okay, so we have here um, a diagram of a circle with center O and the sector and major sector and the major and minor arcs are indicated. Okay, so we have a major arc here being the dotted line going from F all the way around to E, the just the dotted line. Um, this portion here will be the minor arc. It's not labeled, but I can label it minor arc. Now, what they want us to do is to identify the circumference, well, to, to calculate the circumference of the circle, given that the major arc, that is a dotted line all around, is 40 centimeters, just a dotted line portion. So I can put that here as 40 centimeters. Now, what I'm going to do is to figure out what's the, the, the arc length for one sector. All right. Now, how many sectors can I get out of out of this portion that has the major arc? All right. Well, think about this here, this circle going all the way around. That's 360 degrees, right? Going all the way around, by the way. 360 degrees. If I were to divide it up in, well, 360 degrees. I want to find out how many sectors I can get out of this circle with 60 degrees, each of them being having 60 degrees equally. So 60 goes into its 360 give us 6. So I can get 6 sectors having an angle of 60 degrees. Alright, so in other words, this will go straight down. That will go straight here. Right, and um, this is 60, this is 60. That means 60 plus this is 120, therefore 120. Because 60 plus 120 is this angle in a straight line. I mean, I can divide this up into 60 and 60, right? Which, of course, if I carry this like that, then I have also another 60 and 60. Now, from F here, going all the way around to E, has how many, how many sectors? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, and, that, and, and, and those sectors, right, have arc lengths. Each of them has, each, each one of the sectors has, well, actually not each of them, all five of them, together have an arc length of 40 centimeters going all the way around. So five sectors have arc length of 40 centimeters. Therefore, one sector will have arc length of 40 centimeters divided by five, which is going to be eight centimeters. That makes sense, right? Because all the arc lengths are equal because they all have the same angle. So that is eight centimeters plus eight plus eight plus eight plus eight. And eight five is 40. That makes sense. This is also as eight. So 8, 6 will be 48. So the answer is 48. 